Reviewing Kaylin's Barbecue in Pearland, Texas. So is it Pearland, Texas or Pearland, Texas? You know how y'all Texas like to pronounce stuff a little different. Kaylin's was highly recommended and it's said to be one of the best, if not the best, barbecue spots in the Houston, Texas area. Let's see what it's hitting on. We got the smoked turkey. Mm-hmm. Good Lord. The turkey is surprisingly it's thick and it's peppery and it's smoky and it's juicy. When you bite this, you'll taste the smoky flavor first. Then it kind of gets a little sweet on you. I like this. We got a sausage. Crunch on that mango was serious, huh? The sausage is lit. When you bite into this, I'm telling you right now, the juices are just waiting, just waiting to jump into your mouth. They gave me some sauce. Now, I ain't never dipped in sausage in sauce before. Oh my God. Killings is definitely killing so far. Got some brisket for your eh? Juicy, fatty, meaty, but not too fatty. Whoever trimmed the fat off this mug was brilliant. And whoever seasoned it, see the details right there? See that? Mm. Deserves an award. The brisket is on point. Potato salad. I'll prefer more relish because I'm a relish guy. But I can definitely taste the honey mustard in this mug. It's very pronounced. Overall, the potato salad is better than most. This is the collets. I can see these being a little bit too acidic for some of you guys, because it is just a little sour. If I had to make any changes to this, I would cut back on what it appears to be the vinegar and use a little bit more salt and pepper. But overall, it's all right. Ladies and gentlemen, this would be the beef rib. And I'm telling you right now, it's crazy big. When it comes down to ribs, beef ribs over pork ribs all day, argue with your granny. This is a pound of beef ribs. When I say it is juicy and extremely meaty, damn it, you better listen to me. Cause I am not lying. Looks like there's some fat right here. I'm gonna try. Mm. Ain't gonna lie, when you bite into this, you better close your eyes. But this most definitely gonna take you to a place you ain't never been before. But there is a negative. For some of y'all, and to be honest with you, for me too, the bark has way too much bite. They use a little too much salt and pepper for me. But overall, man, I'm gonna tell you right now, if you come here, you've got to get this. If you're in Houston, Texas, you have to try this place out.